Hi, I'm Richard Byrne. In this video, I want to show you one of my favorite little features of Schoolytics. Let's go ahead and take a look here at Schoolytics.com. If you're not familiar with it, it's a tool that teachers can use for free to synchronize all the information across all of their Google Classrooms. And here I am signed into my account. You can see I'm signed in right now and I have nine classes connected. Now these are all my demo classes that I've created over the last year that are in here. And you can see I have a list of all my students here across all of my classes. And I can see current completion rate for my classes. But my favorite little feature is this little note right here. You can see I'm in my Schoolytics Home Report Dashboard. It, this little feature is called send high fives to students and what this allows you to do is set some filters for giving your students virtual high fives or a little kudos for reaching goals or standards that you've set now the default is to complete 85 percent of assignments over a 30-day period but you can change that out so I could make this 50 and I can say that the goal is 50% completion over the last 30 days. And I'll see there that I have one student so far who has met that requirement. But there are other options I could pick from besides assignment completion. I can say just total number of assignments completed instead of the percentage completed. Or I could say points and give out kudos or virtual high fives based on a points average. But I'm going to use this assignment completion and for my demo here 50% is the minimum completion rate that I want for my students. And now I can send this out and say that my students are going to get a virtual high five for completing 50% of their assignments over the last 30 days. I can also put this in the stream for my Google Classroom and announce that out to my Google Classroom as well. So that's the virtual high five option that you can use in Schoolytics to reward your students for reaching certain goals or standards that you've set. To learn more about Schoolytics, please click the link in the description down below or go to schoolytics.com. And as always, for more things like this, please visit freetechforteachers.com or subscribe to my YouTube channel.